Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Persis Plays RimWorld. As always, there's a link in the video description to the playlist, so you can skip around and watch them in a row if you want to. So, we're here, we're right where we left off. Uh, I think I said we want to do some uh, surgeries here, so let's see about how everybody's looking in uh, as far as their legs. We have spare legs, we have a simple prosthetic leg, and we have bionic legs. So, uh, well, actually, one of each, actually, only. <clears throat> So, a simple prosthetic leg is not as good as a regular leg, but it's better than a peg leg. Uh, so, let's see. No shut off, left thumb destroyed. Bambi, we didn't get an arm, unfortunately. If we got a prosthetic arm, we could have we put that on uh, Bambi's shoulder there. Uh, but not so much. But Bambi does have a leg missing. Right leg. Let's see. Gunshot injury in the eye. Shattered ribs. A peg leg over here on Pearson. Wow, pinky shot off, thumb bitten off. God, these guys are brutalized. Little toe cut off, right eye shot out. Man, look at this, eye cut out, rib shattered. Man, maybe this is why we're, we're having labor problems. Everybody's all like destroyed over between all these like uh, little fights we've had and raids and stuff. Okay, so uh, the peg leg people, we've got Bambi and we've got Pearson. So, what we're going to do, it's her right leg. Let's start with Pearson. Uh, we're going to go ahead and schedule. Install. I think you're going to get uh, the bionic leg, and that was on your right leg. So, bionic leg, right leg. Perfect. And then, just like we did when we did the peg leg, we're going to rest her until healed. And we're going to send our best guy, which I believe is Anna over to install the peg leg or the uh the bionic leg on pearson and then pearson is going to fly around here super fast with her bionic leg and bambi unfortunately let's see if it goes okay doesn't fail yes bionic leg all right so pearson is going to be cruising along bambi you have a peg leg mm, not the best it's your right leg so install simple prosthetic leg on the right leg just like that, and just the same, we're going to rest you until healed. Or actually, you know what, let's clean up some of this dirt on the way. I probably should have done that before we did the bionic leg. Where are you going, Bambi? Why well, won't Where are you going? But clean the dirt, okay. And rest until healed. Great. So let's get Anna in here, do the operation. And over time, hopefully, uh, we will be able to get everybody hooked up with, uh, here we go, peg leg, should be a simple prosthetic leg. Nice. All right, cool. Uh, so over time, we should be able to uh, get everybody all cooked up, and let's see, where's Pearson at? Let's see how fast Pearson's moving now. Look at this. Because bionic leg is actually better than regular leg. And she's been hobbling along on a... Uh, where are we at here? Health. She's been hobbling along on uh, a peg leg all this time. But now this leg is 140%. So it's like 40% better. And now she moves way faster. 109%. Of course, consciousness. Uh, because her breathing is ass. Why does her breathing suck? Because of the penoxicillin? What? Breathing. What's wrong with her lungs? I don't know. Is there an eye? Thumb pinky, right? It's a stab scar. Big deal. It, oh, it's these ribs. Okay. In any case. <clears throat> so, we're slowly getting getting things together. We can't make this one piece of carpet because this is on top of it. So, let me get rid of that. Uh, Anna. Oh, we got another animal giving birth. Oh, wow. We got three husky puppies out of that one. Uh, and you're going to sit in the baby zone. Got volcanic winter. Oh no. <clears throat> the ash will obscure the sun, temperatures temperatures will drop, and plants will suffer for lack of sunlight. Could pass in a few weeks or could last for many seasons. That is not good. Alright, I think I think the time has come. Let's get this research done. Where's uh our research guy? Hippo. He's sewing and now he's researching. Alright, finish this off, please, real quick. And let me make sure we got you on top priority. There we go. All right. I want to get this done. We're going to we're going to research hydroponics. 
just got tabbed out by like virus software. All right, ship antimatter. That's done. Great. Let's go and do hydroponics. I've had quite enough of our food problems. This is what's happening next. So Hippo's going to research it. And because he's so good at research, it just happened quick enough. And what we're going to do is build a whole hydroponics lab uh, somewhere relatively close. Maybe, maybe we'll do it right here or right here. I don't know. Somewhere. Okay. Well, in any case, I'm going to go ahead and skip ahead again, uh, probably until we get the hydroponics lab. I might just, uh, yeah, that's just what I'm going to do. All right. So I'll see you guys in a few. All right. We're back. Um, I started building our hydroponics lab. And what I did is I built, just to show you, because I kind of wanted to get it all started. If you go into furniture right near where you have the actual standing lamps for lights, there's a sun lamp. And what that does is it gives you an area that crops will grow it's it's sunny and i gave you know put the chiller and the heater and other regular thing and i built a whole box out of slate with doors and all that and a wood floor so that's getting made and once that's done we'll be able to start plunking some uh, hydroponics basins in there excuse me and i also placed an order for a bunch of exotic goods uh traders and like another another set of three traders and I also, a thing I probably should have done on camera, uh, that one last faction here, Nabago of the Cliff, uh, they're now friends of ours because I just basically donated a bunch of silver over to them and now they're friends of ours. So they should be one of the three people that we have uh, visiting with a trade caravan. So they're not uh, angry with us anymore, which is great. Uh, we can get rid of some of these like new puppies because we just got a whole bunch of them. Uh, so we don't want to go too crazy with too many things to feed. Okay, let's see what they got. Ah, bionic eye, simple prosthetic arm. Nice. Perfect. All right, so the um, exotic goods uh, traders have all this kind of cool stuff. Uh, let's see. Uranium. We can sell a little. We do need some uranium, but we, we do have some in under our thing. I don't want to go too crazy selling uranium. They have some components... Uh, I don't want to sell too much other things here. Uh, we got a young elephant, but I don't want to sell our elephants. Our elephants are precious to us. We are going to need a bunch of plasteel. Uh, let's sell, just because I don't want to... I did get the uh, prosthetic arm and the bionic eye. And we could get a liver too if we wanted to, but unfortunately I didn't... Uh, hmm. Because they don't buy like bulk goods stuff, so I didn't get a chance to, I should have gone to the bulk goods trader first. Um, let's just sell like a hundred of the uranium so that this is all even just like that. Uh, Anna, hold the bionic eye. We don't want this stuff going bad. Kanuki, you're building. Hector, you're harvesting. Oh, well, I guess that's okay. All right. So that's one of the traders done. Let's get Anna over to this one. See if we can sell off some of our other bulk goods. All right. Uh, now we're just trying to get our money back on the uh, bulk goods traders. So let's see. Smoke leaf joints. We can sell like 10 of these or 9 of these. Just like that. Um, are they not taking cloth? Okay, they'll take cloth. All right. So we can get rid of all the spare crappy leather. 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 And how are we doing on... Yeah, we'll keep the rest of that leather. And we'll just get rid of, like, 500 cloth. Whoa. 500 cloth. Okay. 600 cloth. Damn it. What? Minus 600. Oh, oh. There we go. All right, perfect. And we'll try to get some of our money back that we just spent in the exotic goods trainer. Or the exotic goods... Uh, <clears throat> seller unfortunately we didn't have any exotic goods to sell back to them so it's just a matter of that okay now we've got another one down here send Anna down and this volcanic winter we're going to be getting ahead of as soon as we get our hydroponics up and running uh, let's see what do they want we can sell off we have a ton of leather so let's sell off this stack of leather here and we can sell off some more cloth, like minus 500, 1021, yep, 
good. All right. Looking good. Feeling good. Um, yeah, pretty, pretty good. Pretty good. Still, we're still up on, uh, here we go. 1057. There we go. Perfect. All right. So we're still up on silver. Uh, we just got some of it back. Uh, and we got ourselves a bionic eye and a prosthetic arm. And of course, we want the prosthetic arm to go on to, uh, who was it? It was Bambi. Bambi's missing her arm, right? So, let's go ahead and do that right now. Our left arm shot off. We're going to do install simple prosthetic arm into her left, left shoulder, right? Yeah, left. I want to make sure I do that right. Left arm shot off. Okay, good. So, let's go ahead and do the same old thing and actually clean the dirt first. I mean, you're, we're only installing a prosthetic, so I don't necessarily think that we'll have any problems, but we'll just see what happens. Hopefully, we won't have wasted all the money we spent on the prosthetics. And unfortunately, prosthetics is one of those things like that you can't build yourself. You can't just make a uh, <clears throat> like a like a workbench and do it, tinker it on your like thing that you make assault rifles on. I think I would think you could make at least prosthetics. All right, so Bambi now has simple prosthetic arm. Uh, we'll figure out who we want to give the bionic eye to uh, later. Looks like everybody's just chunking around, hanging out. They're like, "Oh, what's going to be in here? Is it going to be this, this? Looks like the makings of a hydroponics lab, man." Wish I had a hydroponics lab. So that's what's going on there. Maybe we'll cut away again and until all this stuff is done and uh, see where we get from there. All right, see you in a few. All right, so our stuff down here is uh, almost done. It's getting there. Uh, the trees keep growing in so fast that we can't get the floor down, but we'll get there from here. And then, of course, we have a raid. So let's get the squad together. Oh, these guys are coming quick. Just draft them all up and they let's see they got grenades they got some clubs more grenades crappy guns okay good so let's start forming up i think this is going to be our place so we'll fan out a little bit because they have grenades The boss died. The boss of the Owlman has died. That's what you get. How dare you. Alright. Huh. There goes the smoke pop belt. Remember I had said that smoke pop belt is one of the things which we can uh, research. That's what it is right there. If you get shot it gives them... The, the thing pops and then they get to... Uh, it gives them a little bit of cover. That's basically what a smoke pop belt is. Did we take any damage at all? Wow, we just came through that like a, like a champ. Nice. All right, Kim, you can go rest until healed. Logan, you too. Uh, just like that. And we'll see what kind of goodies we got. Man, there's a lot of stuff here. Um, we're going to have a lot of bodies to uh, burn. Ooh, go juice. That's another uh, drug there. Looks like we only have... We only have one survivor, and that's Collier, right there. He's incapable of artistic. That is not a problem. We don't have we don't have issue with that. Do we have? Oh, of course we have a uh, prison cell just ready for you. So Hippo, go and uh, strip Collier, and we'll get some of these people back to doing their thing. Hippo, oh, we got a combat supplier as well. We're gonna capture Collier, or Collier, or whatever. Um, that unforbid this unforbid this and while you're at it why don't you go ahead and haul some of this stuff as well on your way back prioritize hauling go juice haul. okay cool so looks like we got a ah, trade ship nice but it's another combat supplier so we can't get a mad amount of uh, loot off them because we can only sell certain things so let's give them a call and see what they have for us all right well we can actually sell some of the crap that uh oh actually it won't be near the um damn all that stuff that just got uh we got in that raid won't be nearby the um the the trade orbital trade beacon so we're going to keep a couple of these guns 
decent ones. LMG, okay. I think from here up, we'll just sell any of this crap. It's all going from there up, because uh, we're keeping like three of them. Uh, Molotovs, EMP grenades, frag grenades, they're all going, because we never want to use those. Fine. Uh, wooden club, okay. Five bucks for that? Yeah, by all means, take it. Uh, go juice, absolutely. Uh, get rid of that. Get rid of a little bit of smoke leaf. And we have mortar shells left over from something else. Good. Components, medicine. We don't want to sell any of that stuff. Uh, we can actually buy some medicine. We have that one hospital bed that still hasn't been made. But we're doing not doing so great on gold or on silver. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, get that going. All right. Perfect. Uh, so what else do we want to do? Let's go ahead and who? let's figure out who's going to get this eye. Um, all right. Hippo, I think we have a, a quite a few people that are missing eyes, if I'm honest. Uh, the nose is shot off. Uh, left eye torn out. This is Bambi with her prosthetic arm and prosthetic leg. Uh, gunshot. Yeah, Pearson. How are we doing? Your eyes look all right. Mitch, your right eye is shot off. Oh, my God. There's there's quite a, quite a few people missing eyes. Left eye cut off. <laughs> All right, who are our best guys with eye? Uh, with uh, you know what, Bambi? This is what we're gonna do. Left eye, stole bionic eye, left eye. Because you didn't get any of the bionic uh, limbs, you're gonna get the bionic eye, and you're gonna come in here, and you're gonna clean so that hopefully we'll have the best chance. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? So hopefully you'll have the best chance of uh, coming through this without wasting that eye. And let's get Anna in and... Oh, need materials. What? Oh, because Pearson's trying to do it. No, Pearson... No, 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 no. Anna's, Anna's going to do the operation here. And we got some... Yes, Saraway Revenge. All right, let's see where Anna's at. Anna's going to grab the eye. Pearson, clean the dirt. And here comes Anna with the bionic eye. All right, cross your fingers. We don't want to lose either Bambi or the eye. Nice. All right, so Bambi has prosthetic eye, or the bionic eye. Looking good. We got some cargo pods. Let's see what we get. Uh, a couple blocks. Fine, you guys can haul that at your leisure. Whoop, combat supplier. Okay, a battery's broken down. Combat supplier, jump to location. May as well sell, and I don't think we have anything to sell to this guy because uh, we just had the combat supplier trade ship, so we just used up all our good stuff. Uh, but let's see if they'll take any of this other crap. Uh, bolt action rifle, well, no. Okay, so some of this stuff, this is the stuff that hasn't been hauled yet, so we can get rid of the Molotovs. We're keeping machine pistol, LMG. We can get rid of pump shotgun, bolt action rifle, steel club. Because um, we have plenty enough steel right now. We're not worried about melting that down. All right, so we'll just get a little bit of silver from these people. Sounds good. Uh, this isn't our pet boar, so let's go ahead and hunt it. And how are we looking? Uh, we don't have any meat, so we got to do some hunting so that we can make some kibble. Uh, and that's the frustrating thing, is that kibble requires both meat and vegetables. So, like... When your corn dies, you can't make any kibble and your animals starve. When you don't do hunting because you're concentrating so much on getting your hydroponics basin ready. Uh, again, no kibble. What's that? Oh, free emu. Okay, take that. And turtles take so goddamn long to hunt. Stick with the boars and the chinchillas and the cassowaries or cassowaries or however it's pronounced and i don't really care too much how it's pronounced so oh good alpha beavers all right uh and they keep the alpha beavers keep coming to this area here and by all means you guys can knock yourself silly um let's see what else we did a pilot hole of mining right through here and of course we struck a bunch of steel which is nice do that, we'll haul this sandstone, just like that, good. All right, so let's go ahead and start to plan. Now, when you look at the outline, this is the area that the sun lamp actually uh, works in. So we take the hydroponics basins and we wanna put them all around the area. So uh, 
we're just going to kind of stack them in. One, two, three. And we don't have a crazy amount of uh, components, but we'll just start with that many for now. And slowly, slowly but surely, they'll start to get um, all plugged in. Good. Do we get... Ah, Collier. Nice. All right, so Collier's been tended to. Let's send him to chat and recruit as well. Um, good luck with that because we still haven't gotten anybody to join our stupid colony. Uh, Hippo is researching away. Uh, some at, at one point when I paused it, we had uh, finished something else, so I just set it on the next thing. Bulk goods trader. It's a trade ship. Nice. Okay, good. Let's uh, go ahead and call that with Anna. Whatever she's doing, just stop. All right, let's see what we can sell. Uh, we got a ton of animals, like an absolute ton. Um, let's get rid of some of these huskies. Good. Flannel. We, we Our colonists have started to name some of the elephants. We got Dusty and Flannel. Flannel is a good name for an elephant, I believe. <laughs> I'll take that. All right. Uh, we can get rid of some of this chem fuel. And just like that, we're going to take all their money away from them. Uh, let's see. Neutramine. We're actually pretty good on Neutramine, but we can use more components because we're going to need them for all the hydro basins and all the ship parts and stuff. So we're going to need tons of those. Uh, medicine, smoke leaf. We didn't make any more smoke leaf. Uh, steel, uranium, plast steel. Okay, so bulk goods traders will take some of this stuff too. Uh, they'll actually take some of these blocks. That's great. Take, take the marble blocks and the limestone blocks because basically we're just using these two blocks uh, to build all of our stuff. So let's go ahead and get rid of some of these low uh, percentage t-shirts and stuff like that. We're going to have to make some more at some point, I'm sure. But for the meantime, let's get rid of some of these. Uh, we don't want to buy any of this crap. Great. Um, let's see. What else? How are we doing on leather? We got rid of most of our leather, so we're just hanging on to like elephant leather and pig skin which is fine we need those for dusters let's get rid of some cloth like 500 cloth just like that uh all right so we're coming out with some components and about 2,000 uh silver worth of things let's also uh elephants we like our elephants but get rid of another husky all right sounds good so let's just make sure the components get your hunting wild boar who's around you're making a smoke leaf joint now Hold the components so that they don't go bad. <clears throat> Get them inside, and then you can go make some smoke leaf joints. Perfect. All right, where's our cleaner? He's playing billiards. Because I see that this place is an absolute pigsty, Mitch. Get on it. There he goes. Mop, 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 all day long. Mop, 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 while well, I sing this song. Mitch, convince one of these prisoners to join us, and you won't have to clean dirt anymore. That's that's pretty much the deal. That's what you got to do, but it's not happening. So, what can I tell you? You're the, you're the dirt. What is he doing? Meditating. All right, let him, let him meditate a little bit, and then he can clean the dirt around the billiards table. Where he's sitting in his chair. He's sitting in his chair to meditate. That's great. All right, now he's eating, and now boom, right back to cleaning the dirt. You saw the dirt around the billiards table, but you elected not to clean it. So, there you go. All right. So, we're getting some of our cleaning done. Hydroponics stuff is going to be coming sooner or later. Yeah, Pearson's bringing some of the stuff in now. Are we actually running out of... Okay, we're not running out of juice. I was worried when that goes off because the deal with these sun lamps is they turn on and turn off to uh, simulate sunlight uh, so that the plants have a chance to rest, which is why I also have regular lamps set to go in here so that people when people go inside to like pick the flowers and stuff like that uh they can actually see so that's what's going on there how's everybody looking is everyone going to sleep Kanuki hunting alpha beaver let's get this finished here we get enough people out hunting alpha beavers you can come and actually complete some of this stuff cutting down some of the trees oh whoa, whoa, whoa. i want to be able to see in here buddy so get get that standing lamp going and then we'll let him get to sleep maybe if he's good let's see man that's a long run let's get the steel from there to there okay now we can see inside 
All right, go to sleep. Enjoy yourself. All right, so uh, let's see where we at. 25 minutes. We might be able to get a little more done uh, before we close out this video. Uh, let's go ahead and set some more stuff for hunting. Just like that. And we might need more power. So maybe we'll do another... Hmm. Our little solar panel block here. We can mine out psychic ship. Oh, no. Well, I guess that answers the question as to uh, what else we're going to be doing with the rest of this video. So here we go again. We've played this game before. Uh, let's go ahead and get the squad out. Everyone out of bed. Let's go. Let's kind of get them all. Now, of course, there's a fire burning, and it's not raining, but it's burn it looks like it's burning out. All right, so... Uh, Let's try to get people in a bit of cover around the psychic ship while they can. Pisa down here behind some trees. Behind some Treza. Another guy over here. And Mitch, last but not least, take cover here. Alright. Looks like we've got our we've got our area. So Pearson, pop it. And get yet another centipede. And Pearson, in the meantime, you can you can. All right, now that the centipede's down, now we can like grab all these guys, shoot the ship, and grab all these guys and shoot the centipede. All right, that went pretty easy. That went pretty easy. I don't think I don't think anybody even took a single hit. That's that's pretty well, except for our animals who just love running in the way. Come on, shoot it down. Man, these things take so much beating. Bones has been bitten to death. Oh, God. I let the animals out again because we were running low on food. Oh, boy. All right, let's put the babies back inside. I hope it wasn't an uh, elephant that got bitten to death by a cobra. It always happens when we're in the middle of, like, shooting down let's go come on finish it Jesus Christ look at the beating this thing's taking that thing died in the crossfire let's see if that pig dies in the crossfire too look at this all right finally all right so we're gonna unforbid 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 uh, we're gonna take everybody and we're gonna undraft them and let's make sure that some of this stuff gets hauled ASAP because that stuff's very, very important. Great. Uh, how are we doing? Got some kibble okay. So the animals that we just put in there. Uh, and of course, we have recruitment failures left, right, and center. Collier not coming in. Collier, Collier, Co Collier. I don't know. Uh, not coming in. So we'll let that go. Uh, who's our best? All right, Kanuki went back to sleep. Uh, Pearson is another good uh, construction guy. Working on a recruiting Madden down there. And of course, if we watch it, it's not going to happen. Nope, no luck. All right. Uh, Pearson's trying to recruit Collier now. Trying to recruit Arthur. Cargo pods. Let's see what we get. We got some dubs. All right. We'll sell them. That's fine. All right. Looking good. Let's get Pearson. Try to get some of this stuff done here. And finish once and for all. Get these hydroponics basins up and running. Of course, it doesn't help that, like, the floor isn't put in or any other stuff. Oh, there we go. Kanuki woke up, and he's starting to work on stuff, too. Great. And this... What is it? Cecropia. Cecropia tree. All right. And we got one hydroponics basin up and running, and what we're going to do is plant some rice in it. Instead of potatoes. I don't know why it's default potatoes, but uh, I think rice is a little better. Kanuki... Oh, we still got to haul all this crap there, too, while we're at it. 
And Hector, why don't you get in here and cut some of these trees down so that these guys can finish. Because you're no good at construction. Get the Cecropia trees. And the Teak trees. Gone once, once and for all. More cargo pods. Oh, great. Oh, look at all this silver. That's what came down in that. Nice. All right. Get some of this stuff closer because we are using that. Cut the raspberry bush. Pretty good. Pretty good. All right. And we've got a couple more hydroponics basins. And we're going to want all rice plants. And with the hydroponics basins, you can't plant anything you want. So you can plant like heel root and stuff like that. But you can't plant like corn. Uh, but you can plant, you know, smoke leaf and a couple different um, food crops. Actually, let's do strawberries. Prison break. Uh-oh. Someone's going to about to get shot in the head. Madden's down. Bowman's down. Arthur's down. And Bowman has been shot to death. So, yeah. You reap what you sow, I guess. Uh, stop trying to break out, guys. Really. I mean, what else can I say? Uh, yeah. Oh, no. He's dead. He's, he's good and dead. All right, let's get to it. Oh, no, Kim, you're closer. All right, let's see. Maybe these guys will die on us, too. Arthur, whew, looking bad. Madden, not looking good either. All right, well, our guys are tending to him. So that's one more prisoner down. One more prisoner bites the dust. And Kanuki's coming to repair all the stuff that got shot in the meantime. <laughs> Would you guys please... Look, look, 63%, 82%, 97%, 92%. I mean, some of you guys should really be joining us. I, we, we haven't had any people join. Maybe I, I'm telling you, our prisons are filthy. But I don't want to... I don't want to, like, bump them out a little because I'd have to move all these uh, things. And you... Oh, actually, we can reinstall. Hmm. Because some things, like beds and billiards tables, you can actually reinstall in a different place. And some things you have to actually deconstruct and you lose materials. So actually, we can, like, pump these out. Maybe I can help. Uh-oh, somebody's got an infection. Let me just put the orders in for this. And oh, no. I've, I've taken this video way too long. Reinstall that, and reinstall that. So this will give us some room. We can bump these things out a little, so not in little crappy cells. And Madden has an infection. Uh, looks like Kim is tending to Madden as we speak, so that's good. Uh, those things will get moved around. Our hydroponics basin has started, has started to get put together, and it looks like uh, strawberry plants are getting put in just like that. Nice. Uh, let's switch this to strawberries. Switch this to strawberries. Actually, no, no, we're okay. All right. Um, I'm going to go ahead. I want to, want to, I want to end this video because uh, it's been going for like 32 minutes or so. Uh, so I appreciate it very much if you're watching this video and this video series. I hope you're enjoying it. I hope it's not dragging on too long. That's why I'm doing these cutaways because I don't want to like, you know, you just have to watch our dudes just like run around and you know mine and stuff like that i'm trying to just cut in when we actually do things and make a little progress so uh until next time i'll catch you guys later